Back around a source, be cool. Are you just trying to trying to sneak up on me? I'm still working on a theory that uh or working under the theory that in this game, anything that is even remotely hostile to players, whether like actively hunting you or just defensive, uh as soon as it like gets within a certain range, it's going to start wandering over to you. Like it is programmed to seek you out. Like this Dillo. This Dillo just will not go away. Look at him. He was walking that way the last time I saw him. Now he's just here. What are you? Huh? What 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 do you do? Prime knockback. Hmm. Knock this back. Okay, never mind. Use the rocks. Dodge and evade. Hey, any, any of you guys want to fight him? Oh, we got another Lister Sword situation here, I can tell. Actually, no, he might be getting bloody. Oh, no, he's getting bloody. I think. Yeah. The, the red splotches on him are reflective. That's blood. Gotcha. Oh, what, what? You running now? Huh? You was talking that good shit a second ago. Hey, there you are. Broadside. I see you, Diplo. I see you, and I know you're kind. Come back. Come back, Dillo. Your fate is with me. I feel like taming you would have been awesome. But nope, I can't do that. And you wouldn't leave me alone, so... Until I gathered up the resources to tame you. So now you must become level fodder. Mm, this is a special kind of dumb. Gotcha. Okay, we're uh, back to being somewhat safe. Holy crap, eight levels from that. Okay. Oh, okay, I can make this one. Beta knockout stuff. How to make beta sedative then? Beta essence narcotic. Okay, well. I will have narcotic online shortly. Maybe. Art gods permitting. I don't like the number of Diplos around here. The Diplos I do not enjoy. Prime Collective Parasaur. What does that mean? Ah, yes, I think I can make the meat spoiler now. Yep, just need wood. And then we got Narcotic Online. I still need a lot of berries, so we're not we're not as good as I would like. Progress is being made. Yes. Yeah, diplos might be good for something here shortly. Big old poops. Give me them giant poops. What's that? I don't even want to get close to you because you're a Diplo and you guys are assholes when anybody gets within range. I feel like the Bronto would probably be a safer bet to try to get, like, the giant turds. I mean, reasonably sure he won't just attack me out of the blue. Okay, so about a thousand Torpor for this, and it says... Uh, so... Eight times Torpor of Narcotics, and you are... Five times, ten times. Okay, so you are actually stronger. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with you guys. I like having the Trank Boomerang. 
Trying boomerang is fun. So I'm at least gonna make that. That's a Rex. There is a Rex up there. Oh, and it is not a normal one. It throws like poison shit. Okay. That's a spectral Bronto. I don't think it going invisible is going to help it at all. But who knows, maybe it has just ridiculous health. Like that Lystrosaur. I mean, I do like to live dang- Nope, he- that- that Bronto is dead. That Rex is... That Rex is king of the hill right now. Yeah, that- that Rex is... Oh, no, that Bronto is still there. Did the Rex actually lose track of him? Yeah, it went- went from being relatively safe to being... Uh, so very not safe. Omega Banshee Parasaur. Uh, level 133. Mm. Mm. That would be alright with me. I feel like this Rex is going to eventually aggro on you guys. And he's going to come down here looking for you. And he's going to find me. That's that's what I feel like is going to happen. Because that's kind of what you paras do. You just... You attract things. And just lead them to, to, to me. Okay, so collective parasaur, but you somehow get a mate boost from a banshee parasaur. What was that? Is that an Aranio? Or like a mini... Oh no, that Rex is down here. That Rex is coming. What the hell are you? I'm not going to sit here and say it couldn't be worse, but like it, it, it would be the game would be hard pressed to make this worse right now. I shouldn't have said that. I should not have said that. And I just look up in the sky and there's like a fucking dodo wyvern. Yeah, that Rex is going to kill everything around here. And I honestly don't think there's anything here that can stop it. Especially because it heals when it kills stuff. So you, no matter how much damage something does to it, if it still loses the fight and gets eaten, then like that, that's it. Should I attempt to help or something? Holy shit. Um. Okay. I recorded that, didn't I? Yes, I did. I, I recorded that. Hell yeah. Um, could you get out of the way so I can harvest this? I, I want to harvest this. Yeah, I'll harvest the tail. I don't care. Can I access his inventory? Does he have an inventory? Nope. Not really. Oh, see? See? This is exactly what I'm talking about. The goddamn Diplos. Motherfucker just did... 76 damage to me for no reason. I ain't do a damn thing to you. I was just here. And he wants to have problems. Yeah, he's kind of, he's still coming over here. He's, he's still doing that. Um. Okay. 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 I just took on a goddamn Rex and won. And now suddenly you're the biggest threat? I don't like that I'm not getting any prime meat or anything out of this. Yes, yeah, so now I really gotta watch him. He is the single biggest threat out here. You know, followed by the, the blue one over there. And yeah, I wish the Rex had have at least killed you, but... And if my little theory is correct, watch that uh watch that Diplo wander his way back over here. Alright, things have been accomplished. Uh th things have happened. You know? I'll take everything I can get in regards to taming stuff. Alright, there there will be multiple attempts. Oh maybe. I'm I'm probably gonna die a lot. 
just trying to do some some stupid crap here. Nope, oh, there he is. He's he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Uh huh. See what I tell you? What did I tell you? I told you. I told you he would come back over here. I fucking told you. Yeah, I know how this shit works. Okay. You know what? I uh, I have stuff now. Okay. So what I am going to attempt to do here, I want to try to tame one of which one? Of, which one of you? Which one of you? Yeah, I want to try to tame you, the Omega Banshee Parasaur. I want to <laughs> shut up. Yeah, I see you. I mean, it's nice that you're right there, but you know. You're probably going to drop the present like in the water or something. But, or you're probably like way further than I think you are. And you're probably going to drop it like over there on top of the cliff. You're going to drop it someplace I can't get to. Uh, yep. I see it. And yep, that that's all the way over there. That is not on the beach or anything. Just like I thought. You know, and all the time I've been playing Ark, I've literally never been able to take advantage of the Raptor Claws thing because, like, the shit always drops on the other side of the map from where I am. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna have a better chance than this. Try to tame something here. God damn it. That should not have happened. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Oh God, he's quick. He is, he is fast. I must bolo this man. All right, uh, we're gonna just gonna. Uh, whoa. Okay, so that's what he does. Um, right. Just broke all my armor, broke everything. Broke me. Wow, just immediate 12,000 damage. Okay. Wait, what? What just dropped? What's over here? Wait, did the raptor claws actually drop a present right here? Holy shit. Okay. Uh, we go see. We go see what it is and probably die trying to get it. What? Oh. Okay. Well, that's... I mean, of course, a reactive Sarko. You know? Everybody's heard of those. I, I simply wasn't watching where I was going. I mean, actually, no, it is my fault for th forever thinking that something nice was happening. You know, thinking that may maybe Raptor Claws dropped a present or maybe it was something cool, like, you know, a drop that's like exclusive to the Omega mod. I'm a goddamn idiot. Of course, that's not the case. Of course, it's the Sarko. A reactive Sarko that can kill you with without you even seeing it. And, you know, of course, because it's a Sarko, it can, you know, come up on land eventually. So I, I have a feeling that's going to be uh, at my front door at some point. Yeah, I'm not even going to bother. Because I'm pretty sure, like, my Torpor, whatever whatever damage I did to him is probably undone now. I mean, unless I could... Nope. Nope, just insta-death. All right, so uh, I think I should probably just go after a raptor or something. 
that para is too much to handle. Uh, so I wonder what the collective para parasaur does. Maybe he might be easier to tame. Uh, let's try this para on for size. See what he do. Is this the right one? Prong Collective Parasol. Okay, that's kind of dangerous with the gotcha just sitting there. Uh oh. How the hell? I'm not doing any damage to him. Okay, I don't know what just happened. Uh, but he doesn't seem to care about me right now. The feeling I'm not gonna do anything to him. Yeah, yeah. Uh, good. I'm gonna hit that Stego, aren't I? Yep, Stego got hit. And now he wants my butt. God damn it! Oh my god, you're never going to go down, are you? I don't know what you're doing, but I'm just going to keep following you. I put quite a bit of work into you. Okay, I mean, you don't really do anything. And still smacked you. Holy shit, finally. I don't know what you eat, though. I guess you eat Metro Berries? How the hell do I know? But yes, I have a... I might have a Parasaur here. Okay, uh... We might have done a thing. I'm amazed that my boomerang didn't break. You know, not, not gonna question it, but just very surprised. Yeah, he's probably not going to eat anything I put in. Like, he's probably not going to eat the berries. This thing probably does not take berries. They probably take some... Some dumb shit that can only be unlocked, like, in mid or late game. For a goddamn Parasaur. Okay, yeah, I feel like he should be eating right now. So... Probably only takes kibble or some garbage like that. Okay. So yeah, gotta, gotta have kibble. Gotta start making kibble. And of course you're just here and I can't do anything about you. It's nice. Sometimes. Okay, I need hide, stone, and wood. Get stone and wood pretty much anywhere. The hide is gonna be a bit more difficult. I don't even know what I can actually kill around here that wouldn't just straight up murk me. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go somewhere and try to find a dodo. Apparently I need to tame one too. A couple of them for the eggs. The Brontos, I mean, they're not gonna keep me safe from anything. In fact, with their AOE, they're probably more likely, likely to kill me than anything else. Like, just getting too close to them when they actually fight something is a very bad idea. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, he's still after me. He's still after me. He is still after me. Um Is he still after me? He still might be on me. Oh no, he's not, but he's like Oh god. How'd that happen? You almost just threw me directly back at the Carnotaurus. Yeah, I mean, it looks like it. He might only have Christmas colors, but I don't trust that at all. I feel like if he was a special one, he would have caught me. So, he might just be a basic bitch, Carno. But even that is beyond my level right now. Spectral Fiomia 130. Nope. After what I dealt with with the spect Spectral Listro, I am not going anywhere near that. Question is, oh no, that's over after. I mean, but can I, is it a regular one? Can I do anything with it? Can I kill it for hide? Possible. Yeah. Okay, something is fighting. No oh, smithy and then metal tools and then I don't know what else. Okay, how are dodos like the most elusive thing right now? But everything else just seems to kind of find me, but thing I'm looking for, no dice. Oh, and look at that. I think the Diplo is wandering its way back over to me. I need more hide. I don't like that hide is not a problem again. I thought we were past this. Ah, yes. Okay, um... Yeah, I'm actually gonna knock you out. And put some berries up your butt. I think that's what dodos take. It's been forever since I tamed a dodo. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to do that, but... I mean, if you're that weak, then oh well. What about you? Can I just... Okay. That's fine. He's Dodo. Pick up Dodo. I have Dodo. Hi, do you want Dodo? Uh, you can't have Dodo. Dodo is mine. Go away. Get your own. Enjoy your new home on the loudest place on Earth. Or off of Earth. This is not Earth. What am I talking about? Ah, okay. Man, just... You can, you can just sit in the door now. Just, just be there. Okay, I, I have a dodo now. Oh, I see you, the goddamn Diplo. Now I do I have to like wait for you to go away? I swear, if you go after my dodo, he has no reason to go after my dodo. But watch him do it. Watch him go after my dodo for no goddamn reason. Ah, okay. Right level to make a Toronto on saddle. I just need... Chitin, oh, keratin, fiber, and hide. No idea where I'm going to get keratin, though. I mean, I got a little bit over from those saber tooths, but uh, that's not going to be my primary source of it. I really need, like, a raptor or something. Something carnivorous. Hmm. If it was possible to tame that carno, I would go for it. Yeah, I can't believe I just said that, but I actually wouldn't mind a carno. If I want to tame that thing, I'm, I have to make a trap. Oh my god, so much stone. Yeah, there's no... Like, I I have to make a trap in order to tame one of those. Nope. Level 46 to make a Chrono Saddle. And I guess... I guess I could make him attack stuff for me. He can be like my bodyguard. Oh, the Diplodocus is gone. Praise be. 
And that Carno is... He's either about to prove his his toughness or he's about to get himself killed by a gotcha. One might be... Oh, no, he, he killed the gotcha. So. And, of course, look at him. Look at him. Wandering his way over here. Just as they always do. He's going to go over there, wreck my base, kill my dodo. Yep, there he goes. Yep, there he goes. Dodo dead. Dodo dead. Everything's wrecked. Yeah, okay. Okay, you little cunt muffin. I'm going to find something to teach you a lesson. Yeah, there's a nice stego over here. A couple of them. Yeah. Yeah, you want to fight? You want to fight? Huh? Yeah, fight these guys. Huh? Yeah, let's see. Let's see how you fare. Oh, look at little bitch running away. But yep, you know, I predicted that. Yeah, my. Where is he going now? Is he going back to fuck up my base again? I mean, you know, silly me for thinking I could have nice things, or not even nice things. I, I just wanted a fucking dodo. That's it. I couldn't even have that. He's just run. He's literally just running. But okay, so yeah, now, now he's he's yeah, yeah. Look at you, little bitch. Where were you before, though? Yeah, biting all more than he could chew, huh? And he's just a regular carnosaurus too. Or carnosaurus. Not even anything special about you. Oh my God! Why are you both down here? Oh, and here's a third one coming to join the party. Mm. God damn it. Yeah, th this is great, isn't it? I haven't even gone anywhere. Uh, I guess this episode has been pretty funny, so it's not an entire bust, but still, like, I have made no progress. And now I'm just kind of, I'm being held hostage here, pretty much. Like one of these. So when I get the next dodo, I can just put him on my shoulder and run back here. I see a raptor up there. Hmm. 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 I am going to go over there and try to tame this raptor. There will be an attempt. We'll see what comes of it. I mean, that parasaur took so damn long to knock out that it wasn't even funny. But, uh. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Mm-hmm. He's literally just f***ing up my stuff. Yeah, and I can't do any f***ing damage to him because he's, like, literally made of rocks. But I can kite him. I can kite him very, very far away. Yeah. Go away. And now does he get out of his ass? Oh my god, the blue one is over there now. You see, you see what I mean? You see what I mean? Dealt with one of them, and now the other one's coming over. Along with that raptor. Yep. Everything is broken. Everything is broken. Oh my god, so many resources. Okay, that's, that Stego has just been a nightmare for any carnivore that dares to come down here. I think that's a pearl raptor or whatever. Or maybe it's one of those chrome dinosaurs. Yeah, I don't know how the hell this thing survived. So it just has a lot of health. 
All right, let's do everything all over again. That's fun. And once again, I have no idea where I'm going to get high. Because I can't find anything that I, that I can actually kill. I guess wait for this raptor to die or something, or... All right, need to find somewhere to get hide. Uh, you're going to be my friend. I need you to be my friend. I'm back here. You had fun with that the last time that's happening thank you oh yeah i wonder if uh who won that fight between that raptor and the stego i should probably go up there and investigate so no i need so much hide i need hide for everything how's it episode three and hide is still such a problem Okay, I think I still see the raptor walking around. Yep. Yep, the raptor is still walking around and getting closer to my base. Because who could have seen that coming? This means this guy must have, like, a little crazy health and crazy torpor. There's no way in hell I'm going to be able to knock that out. I wonder how fast it is. It looks like it's moving at, like, regular speed. This is risky. Nope. He does not get bullied. It's not spawn over there. He's too close. Oh, well, this wasn't much better. Let's kill. What? How the hell did he get all the way over there? Son of a fuck. Okay, this puts a new wrinkle on things. Which looks a lot like all the old wrinkles. Seriously, how the hell did he get all the way over there? What the vampire brontosaurus? What even is that? This is probably a bad, bad idea, but... Never mind. Where the f am I? Oh, and now I have to go by the metal raptor in order to get back to base. In order to get back to my no doubt wrecked base. Dude, you see what I mean about things that are hostile to the player? They just find their way over to you and then never fucking leave. I'm probably gonna freeze it up before I can even get back to shore. And it doesn't matter anyway because all those Brontos are just sitting on top of my base. Like, literally just sitting there. I think we're gonna have to abandon this base. Like, there's... There's there's nothing to be had here. I, I can't do anything about this. You know, I wonder why it just now decided to kill me, though. And which one is it? I'm assuming it's that one, the one that's kind of stuck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's that one. There are just headstones for days out here. Yeah, this was not the place to make a to make a base. Nope, he he's he's on me again. I know what you can come up here. The hell? Oh, bugs, more bugs. Like I don't have enough to deal with right now. 
He's still on me. He's still on me. And so is this fucking bug. Oh, that's a Karna. Overlord Carnotaurus. Hmm. Well, he's not gonna get back to my bed. Okay, that actually worked out for the better. All right, so I, I thought about just like leaving this area to all these assholes. And you know what? No, I earned this place, okay? I'm staying. So right now, the name of the game is gonna be Fortification. I'm gonna make the base out of stone and see how that fares and actually like make walls and everything. And if that doesn't work, then we abandon it. But right now, I'm not giving up. Everything in me is telling me to give up. I'm not doing it. And I feel like pretty much everything in this mod can probably break stone. I'm still gonna try. Cause that's what we do here, we try. But for now, we're gonna save that for the next episode. I wish I had made more progress, but I mean, you guys saw what happened. The the game just ain't having it. And I can already see that Bronzo, you know, I lured him all the way over there. He's making his way closer and closer back over here. But you know what? We'll deal with it. We will deal with it. We will conquer and overcome. You know, I, I say as the Overlord Carno you know, crests over that rock and no, we'll overcome and conquer that too. At some point, someday, not today, probably not tomorrow, but at some point in the future, that thing is going to die by our hand. If you found yourself liking what I do and how I do it, go ahead and drop a like on the video and subscribe for more. As always, thank you all so much for watching. I've been your host, Mr. Killjoy, and until next time, take care, everybody.